Melbourne researchers say they've made a double discovery in the search for a cure for leukaemia. For the first time, scientists have been able to grow cancer stem cells in a lab dish, making it faster and easier to test new treatments. Trent Dan explains. Medical consultations have been a big part of Anthony Michael's life since he was diagnosed with blood cancer in 2006. They said to me, look, meeting the survival three to four years and uh, I've had nine years. The father of two has people like Dr Mark Dawson to thank. Dr Dawson and his team have made a double breakthrough in the fight against the most deadly form of leukaemia. The scientific equivalent of winning a grand final. They've discovered how acute myeloid leukaemia cells become resistant to treatment. This gives them a chance to find other drugs to stop the resilient proteins in their tracks. You know, cancers are intelligent beasts and, and they evolve ways uh, to bypass the challenges we put upon them. Um, and therefore, if you understand the ways they do this, then you have better opportunities. Doctors can also grow cells in a lab dish, giving them another weapon to attack the disease. So we've got an opportunity here to really improve on uh, a therapy that largely hasn't changed for the last 30 years and uh, improve it quite substantially as well. Currently the survival rates for patients is just 25% over five years, but doctors believe these new findings will improve the outlook of the nearly 3,000 sufferers in Australia. They give patients the opportunities to have their lives extended. After five clinical trials, Anthony is proof medical research can save lives. Any extra time is, is appreciated and valuable. Trent Dan, 10 Eyewitness News.